Alright everybody, today I've got a uh, new video for you guys. Um, this is going to be on my Galaxy Nexus. Uh, and this is Jelly Bean Sorcery. It's a new ROM, or newer ROM. Um, really, really cool. I love the features in this thing, so let's get into it. So, um, what we have, let's kind of go into our settings and about phone here, um, and just show you what we're running here. This is Android version uh, 4.2.1, and like I said here, we are on the Galaxy Nexus. This is the uh, Verizon model, um, but let's kind of go into it. Uh, you can see all your other toggles here are... are options, settings, whatever, pretty much standard. The different stuff you have in here is this Jelly Bean Sorcery Control Center, Jelly Bean Sorcery Tools, Jelly Bean Sorcery Info Center, um, and your lock screen security settings. So I'm going to kind of go into those, but first let's kind of look through this, this ROM. Um, as you can see, I have a little cool customization up here for my battery bar, like a little speedometer thing, which is pretty sweet. You can see that the uh, message stuff and the phone is themed. Um, also, your, um, what are these called here, your soft keys down here on the bottom are also a little bit themed. And you can see Gmail here is themed, Market is themed, uh, this is their wallpaper. You can see your uh, toggles here, um, all that stuff's right there, and you can flip them away or go into settings. Um, we'll go back out, let's look at our app drawer. So, uh, app drawer, I've already downloaded a bunch of stuff on here, but let me just show you what is on here from the application itself. Um, right here, File Explorer. This is actually M MIUI File Explorer, which is really cool, because you got down at your bottom, you got these percentages. Um, you got It organizes your pictures, your videos, your apps, your documents. And then if you scroll this way, you have your standard uh, file system. Uh, which is just just real sweet. I like this service a lot. It's got cloud services and everything. You can hook like your Dropbox to it and things like that, um, to just to make it really easy to use. So the file browser is an excellent browser. Um, that comes with it. Let's see what else we got here. Well, here you got uh, Sorcery Tools, Super User that comes with it, and you have. Quickster or Trickster, I'm sorry, Trickster Mod that comes with it. So Trickster Mod, let me just show you guys this application. Um, this has to do with your CPU information, and you can do ADB over Wi-Fi, uh, kernel backup and store. You can uh, put different kernels on it. Um, just all kinds of CPU stuff, min/max on your CPU. Uh, CPU governors, just all, all those goodies are, are right in this sucker right here. Uh, screen controls for coloring, which is just, just super nice. This thing's a really cool uh, uh, app if you really like modding out your uh, device here. And then you have sorcery tools. So this actually has got an insane amount of options on it. You can see all these menus you have. I'm going to go in and show you these because these are actually also in your settings. They are right here, sorcery tools. And you have control center. So let's go through your control center really quick. This just has to do with modding your battery, your clock, your signal, um, stat, status bar mods, navigation bar, power toggles. All these things are like options in here. So this is very much like uh, CM or something like that. You have a lot, a lot of modifications. The thing that I really, really like in this ROM is this sorcery tools. Sorcery tools is basically like having ROM toolbox built into the phone. Is, is probably my best, best way of explaining it. Um, so this thing allows you to go out to their server, I'm assuming, and uh, just download any kind of icon you want. I mean, it's just amazing what this thing does. So you have theming, you have battery icons you got, you got soft keys. So let me just show you soft keys just so you guys can get a, a, an idea of what I'm talking about. So right now you can see my soft keys at the bottom are all blue. Um, I'm going to go down here if I can find these soft keys that I thought were pretty cool. <clears throat> Let's see if I got them here. Hang on. Uh, yeah, right here. So let's say you want PlayStation soft keys just just because. You just hit OK and voila. Now your soft keys look like PlayStation. 
stinking amazing. Um, just, just really, really cool. And if you want to go back to uh, like a stock one, I think stock's down here somewhere at the bottom here. Stock, uh, da, 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 stock ice cream sandwich, boom. And you are back to stock ice cream sandwich keys. So I just love it. I think it's really cool. The customization is, is amazing on this thing. That is probably my favorite thing about this ROM. And you can see you got animations, boot animations, fonts, pull down wallpaper, app wallpaper, mods, app manager. I mean, it, it's, it's, this thing's just full. ROM updates. So if they push or update, you just go in here and hit the update and install it. Bam. Now you just updated your device to their newest update. I mean, the thing is just amazing. So I absolutely love this. Like I say, if you guys have seen ROM Toolbox, it's basically very much like that. So just, just really nice. You have your dev tools, your spare parts, your terminal, all these things which are basically like your, like I say, CM7 or CM Chronogen mod, you know, applications there. Um, ad blocker, fix permissions, battery, white battery stats, zip line applications. I already did that. Very nice. Makes things run a little better. Um, kernel stuff here in it. The build prop editor. The thing, it, 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 it's just full. It's got everything. It, it's just amazing. I love it. So, um, yeah, guys, if you guys want to check this thing out for uh, your Nexus, two things I would recommend. First, make sure you're using the newest Torp Recovery because it really functions well with Jelly Bean 4.2.1. So, basically, all you're going to do is you're going to power off. And make sure you have recovery on here already and obviously root because you have to have that unlock bootloader and all that good stuff. I got videos on that. I'll you know, check my YouTube channel down below. Um, so you're going to reboot the device. Let's say you're not in the ROM right now. Um, go ahead and download all of the files you're going to need again down in my video description down below. And we're going to do reboot recovery and then reboot. So this will get us into a uh, twerp recovery system. From there, we can actually go through and see exactly how to do this. So I will uh, just go through the process for you so you guys can see it. Um, let's see here. Also remember, anytime you flash anything, uh, always try to make sure you have at least 80% battery, um, which I think in Torp you can actually see I have 88% is right on top. So it makes it really easy to see. And as I told you before, I've already got uh, the ROM and the G gaps I need downloaded. So we're gonna go ahead and hit wipes. Oh wait, first, always do a backup of whatever you're running. So hit backup right here in this one and just do a backup just to be safe in case something goes wrong on this install, you can always revert back to that. So we're gonna go to wipes after you do a backup and you're gonna hit Delvic and you're just gonna wipe it, go back, gonna hit cache, wipe it, go back, you're going to hit factory reset, wipe it, go back, and go back again. Then we're going to go to installs, and we're going to scroll down to right here it is, Jelly Sorcery or J JB Sorcery version 4.3 LTE zip, and make sure it's up there, and then flash it. When this is done, we're going to basically just flash our G gaps, and we should be done. Um, should be pretty easy. I'm going to go ahead and let this thing go through its process. We'll flash G gaps and I'll show you boot animation. And that is pretty much the situation here, guys. Uh, pretty simple, not bad, but love the ROM. You guys are really going to like it. Please check it out. As always, uh, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed my video. Um, subscribe down below. Check out my new webpage, rootjunkie.com. It is really, really sweet. Uh, lots of good information on it probably put some links for this kind of stuff. I have a new download page on it. You guys should like this thing out. Please check it out. And uh, let's just let this thing finish here. All right, ROM flashed. So go back, hit our apps, G gaps right there, bam. Flat, flash those suckers. And then we will reboot. All right, there we go. So just hit reboot. I'm gonna show you guys this boot animation because I love me some boot animations. So let's check this thing out. All right, there it is. Team Sorcery, little jelly bean guy with the hat and a magic wand. Quite exciting. Um, there you go, guys. Uh, thanks for watching this video. Again, this is uh, JB Sorcery for the Galaxy Nexus. Um, thanks for watching. P.S. 
This is probably going to take about 10 minutes to load, so be patient on it. Once it is, you're going to love it.